before my Rails final project, I decided to create a proposal generator for freelancers. Um, so what this is, is it'll, it'll allow a freelancer to go onto here, create a proposal which will then be sent to a client. A uh, client will then be able to log in, look over the details of the proposal, and also sign it um, from wherever they are. So I'll just start here. I'm a creative. I'll create a quick account. Test at test.com, just to make it easy. Test, test, password, test, test. Sign up. We'll create a quick proposal here. Okay. SEO slash marketing client email test one at gmail.com. Uh, what this will do is actually create that user account or that client account, like I like, like I mentioned earlier. Uh, budget two thousand dollars. Why me? I'm an SEO genius. Let's put that for now. Planning. Um, brainstorming. We'll go mockups slash execution project completed. So these are the three milestones we're going to set here. It's already got my signature with uh, my current email right there. We'll go ahead and click save changes and that will create the proposal here. So we see this proposal here. It says waiting for signature and awaiting payment. Um, what you can then go do is click on it, and this takes us to the edit page. Um, all these things in here we can edit before we send it to the client, or we can uh, just leave it how it is because we've already done that when we created the proposal. So down here you can see signature and email right here. There's nothing currently because the proposal has not yet been signed by the client. So we'll go back here, we'll sign out, and I'm actually going to log in as the client right now. We can test one at gmail.com and the password is automatically set to default as password123 we'll log in with that we do see this proposal now uh, we can click on it and this looks a little different than the admin's account because um, they can obviously not edit this which is probably something we really want to have um, because we don't want our clients editing you know budget or what we're going to do or whatever so Pretty much all they do, they read it, check it out, everything's okay, click to sign this proposal. You're going to put in their name, test client, you're going to put in their password, password123. You're going to click this box to say they agree, and they're going to sign it. And right now it says signed. There you go. Proposal is now signed. What that means is um, the freelancer, or you, uh, you can now no longer edit this form. So we're going to come back to this main account, test at test.com, and the password is test test. I'm going to log in. And now we see that the proposal has been signed, but we are awaiting payment. Okay, so now we come here and we can no longer edit it. So this only looks to us like it does look to the client. Um, so we come down here and we see that they've signed it and we can see all the details. Um, that's the gist of it. I'm going to go add a few more so I can show you the sort by feature I've got up here. We'll just do test uh, t.com 10,000 blah 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 Submit that there. Got one more. Let's do that. Let's do logo slash branding test at hotmail.com Ten thousand dollars. I'm a branding expert. Um, planning mockups. Final. Okay. Let me save that. And now what we can do here is we can sort it by pipe. Price ascending, descending, decreated. There you go. So we're going to start with this price ascending. You'll see that that is already sorted like that, I guess. Price descending, date created, signed. This one has been signed. These ones have not been signed. So there you go. That's the gist of this web app. Uh, pretty much just to make it easier for uh, freelancers. You know, I'm going to spend hours typing up proposals. So that's what we've got right here. Just a quick little, you know, put it in. We've got some verifications to make sure that an admin can edit it once the proposal has been signed and vice versa from the user side. So yeah, that's it. Uh, Rails final project for Flatiron School.